since his election as Vice President of World Assembly of Youth, WEI, representing the National Youth Council of Nigeria, Comrade Priye J. Ketubu Brown had always made country interest a priority and the image of Nigerian youth paramount. His passion is largely fueled by President Muhammadu Buhari's call for greater youth engagement in governance in his address to the 71st session of the United Nations General Assembly at New York in 2016. It was therefore no surprise that Comrade Ketibu Brown took passionate interest in Nigeria's bid to host the 17th General Assembly of the World Assembly of Youth Way, tentatively scheduled for December 2019. Gratefully, the President of Way, His Excellency, Honorable Datuk Sri Utama Idris Haran for the paved way for Nigeria's chances when he approved Comrade Kitabu Brown's invitation for way inspection visit of facilities, venues and institutions in Abuja, Nigeria. An inspection team was led by Mr. Awani Muhammad Suleiman, a vice president of way and superintended by Ms. Ediola Pashulari, secretary general of way arrived Nigeria July 26, 2019. The delegation were warmly received by Comrade Kitibu Brown and other prominent youth and student leaders at the Inamdi Azikiwe International Airport, Abuja. The Way delegation were lodged at the prestigious Fraser Suites, one of Abuja's finest five-star hotel, courtesy of the benevolence of engineer Jack Rich Tang Jr., a renowned global philanthropist for a field of recreation in Abuja, the Way delegation unwound at the famous Central Park Garden, Abuja. As part of inspection of youth-friendly recreational facilities and places of interest in Abuja, the delegation visited the Abuja Children's Zoo amongst other places of interest. The delegation were treated to a warm, motherly reception by Her Excellency, Dane Pauline Tallinn, Honorable Minister for Women Affairs at her home where she pledged her total support to Nigeria's bid to host the Way General Assembly. Potential venues inspected include Abuja's foremost international conference center, ICC, where the delegation were amazed at the sophistication of the center and its capacity and equipment, all very fitting to host the Way General Assembly. The Way delegation also visited Transcop Hilton Hotel, Abuja's foremost five-star hotel to inspect its magnificent conference hall. The delegation toured the hotel's luxurious recreation and accommodation facilities. The hotel has the unique reputation of having hosted two U.S. presidents, Bill Clinton and Judge W. Bush Jr., on their state visits to Nigeria. The delegation also visited the office of a supporting NGO, the Belama Aid Foundation Incorporated, founded by engineer Jack Rich Tian Jr., who graciously pledged to build a world-class seaside youth resort at the edge of the Atlantic in Kola River State for the World Assembly of Youth to serve as Africa Regional Office of the organization and to do African youths proud. The inspection team met with the Nigeria Police, Abuja Command, Department of State Security, headquarters, and officials of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. The Way delegation also met with senior officials of the Ministry of Youth and Sports Development, led by Mr. Adeshola Ulushade, the Permanent Secretary. Comrade Ketibu Brown, a devotee of the traditional institution, ensured that, that the Way delegation paid due homage to the traditional chief of Garki in Abuja, the Sapeyi of Garki, His Royal Highness Al Haji Dr. Usman Ngakupi, at his palace. The Way delegation also paid homage to His Royal Majesty the Amayanabo of Tuambras and Chairman by also State Council of Traditional Rulers, King Alfred Papa Priye Dieter Spief, at his Abuja home. An elder statesman and an egalitarian personality of no mean repute, he is also Chairman Board of Trustees of World Youth Center Incorporated. Way delegation were honored with visitations by members of the Board of Trustees of the National Youth Council of Nigeria, Mr. Shola Adedeji and Alhaji Bile Tafawa Balewa Jr., 
A colorful delegation of 21 coordinators of a number of state LGA chapters of the council led by comrade Ichigo Chibunna Godwin alongside prominent youth and student leaders such as comrade Uyero Orarawehu Jr., Regional Coordinator, Organization of West African Youths, and Miss Peculiar Mary Asemota JP, President, African Union Students Association, had heartwarming interactions with the Way delegation, all assuring the delegation team of Nigeria youth preparedness to host their peers from around the world should Nigeria win the hosting right. Not resting on his oars, Comrade Ketebu Brown won the heart of Way President and fellow EXCO members who resolved to grant him the privilege to host Nigeria's session of Way EXCO meeting and celebration of the 70th anniversary of Way All in Nigeria. Comrade Ketebu Brown is working round the clock to ensure that all events happen soonest in Nigeria. The National Youth Council of Nigeria is full of praise for the Honorable Minister of Women Affairs and Social Development, Her Excellency, Dame Paul and Tallinn. The Honorable Minister of Youth and Sports Development, Mr. Sunday Dare, Mr. Dixon Akko and Engineer Jack Rich Tang Jr., amongst others, who continue to support Comrade Priye J. Ketabu Brown's tireless commitment in this effort to do Nigerian youth. President Muhammad Buhari's administration Nigerians and indeed the entire Africa proud. The National Youth Council of Nigeria and indeed Nigerian youths remain earnestly grateful to the Way President and his executive committee as we look forward to hosting youth leaders of the world.